Okay, the thing is, you, from my understanding, you believe that everybody has some kind of a God-shaped void in their heart and everybody's trying to fill that void. And from my understanding, you see the fact that I'm asking so many questions to you as like a form of evidence that maybe God is trying to bring me to you or something like that, or like that there's something going on here, right? There's a search. And I would say it's a search for knowledge. And I mentioned to you that I don't believe that we can verify many of these religious beliefs and God beliefs through the same methods we use to verify other types of knowledge. Like, I'm not... I'm not convinced that there's like a way of confirming this with the normal forms of evidence that we use to learn other things. So with that said, how can I have any confidence in this belief, even if I wanted to believe in God? Which, to be honest, I, I really have, I'm, I'm kind of indifferent. If God was real, I'd love to know it. I'd be like, whoa, that, that's surprising. You know, I like to learn new things. I'd be shocked. I'd be like, mm -hmm. my mind would be blown, to be honest. I'd be like, whoa, I want to know. What kind of God is it? How does this work? That doesn't necessarily mean I'm going to believe in it. Like, I just don't really have that desire. I don't know if that makes means I'm, I don't have a soul or something or I'm missing something. But I just really have no... I don't think I have that void that needs to be filled. Mm -hmm. I feel rather content with my search for knowledge as is. And I'm not in search for comfort from any religion or anything like that. But I feel wanna, rather okay. But you want to wanna understand. I want to understand. You're yeah. searching for truth. You're searching for an answer. Mm -hmm. You know, and, th and so thus far you've talked to Christians, you've talked to Buddhists, you've talked to Muslims, and maybe some other people too, in search of that truth. Mm -hmm. I'll just let you know that atheists and agnostics too, yeah. communists. So you're searching. Anarchists. You're searching for an answer. Political know? beliefs as well, right? And, then, and how you're going to know when you find that answer is, is uh, at some point, I, I really believe this for you, <laughs> at some point, you know, God is going to reveal himself to you in some way. Um, Holy Spirit is going to reveal God to you in some way or another, you know? And, and when he does that and the light bulb goes off, you'll understand and you'll know it's truth at that point, even though you don't see it now. Maybe that will happen, but uh, I doubt it. But I'm not against it. If it happens, I mean, yeah, if truth is revealed to me in a certain way that I can be confident in, then I will change my mind. I don't want to be a dogmatist, but I doubt it. And I would just want to ask God and the Holy Spirit, what are you guys waiting for? Because uh, I'm already 31 years old and, mm -hmm. you know, I've talked to a lot of religious people. Mm -hmm. So I, I think my phone's about to end with battery, but we'll keep talking right now. Yeah, yeah.